Let's go! Found one? Wow. I read this post about hanging rainbows in front of our windows for the kids to have something to do while you were walking outside. Honestly, I was like, oh my god, this is such gonna be such a lifesaver because I was struggling so bad. The only thing basically she wanted to do is go for the playground because she's used to that. What was supposed to be like a nice walk and a change of scenery outside became this massive struggle and then okay let's create rainbows we made this kind of daily routine now where we're gonna search for the rainbows outside and what i always do is i open my phone and i show her the rainbow map are we gonna search for rainbows yes people thought it would be really cool if we could find a way to track where all the rainbows were. I said, oh, I know how to do that. Like, this is so much fun. <laughs> I also opened the map publicly so people could add their address and their pinned rainbow directly on the map as well. One of the great things that happened is somebody figured out how to make a, a little rainbow icon and use that as their pin for their location. And when I saw it, I got so excited. I, I changed Everybody is to rainbows. <laughs> Today we have nearly 3,500 rainbows, and those rainbows are all over the world now. They're in the US, they're in Europe, Africa, India, South America, New Zealand. We just got our first Russian rainbow, too. I don't think there's ever been a time in our world where we've all as individuals been going through such a similar experience. And this is a way of showing that, of um, putting our hearts out there and saying, yeah, I get it, I'm there too. This is a way to add a little lightness, I think, for a lot of parents to, to what's going on. And this has been really wonderful in making me feel like I'm still connected to everyone.